Buckle up because we're about to take a wild ride through the world of hypersonic flight, the next big leap in air travel that promises speeds faster than the speed of sound, with only a loud bang left behind as your souvenir. Imagine cutting a flight from New York to London down to just 90 minutes. You could finish your coffee and still have time to argue with the flight attendant about the no eating on takeoff policy. If you're ready to soar into the future of aviation with us, hit that subscribe button faster than a hypersonic jet. It's your ticket to all the latest flight updates. Elon Musk's SpaceX is rumored to be working on a top secret project that could revolutionize hypersonic travel. If anyone can make us fly like we're in a sci-fi movie, it's Elon. So what does this mean for the future of air travel and global connectivity? The quest for hypersonic flight. Now let's dive deeper. The quest for hypersonic flight is like that one ambitious New Year's resolution we all have, promising to revolutionize air travel and reshape global connectivity. While commercial planes typically cruise at a leisurely 550 mph, that's a brisk jog compared to the speed of sound, hypersonic flight aims to achieve speeds of Mach 5, which is about 3,136 mph or higher. You could leave New York and arrive in London before your favorite podcast even finishes. Companies like Hermes, Stratolaunch, and Hypersonics are at the forefront of this technological race. However, the plot thickens. Elon Musk has unveiled the X-1, a revolutionary UFO fighter jet that could redefine air combat. Yes, folks, a UFO. It's not just for conspiracy theorists anymore. The X-1 can achieve hypersonic speeds of 4,600 methanolarb and features revolutionary camouflage technology that renders it virtually invisible to radar. Imagine flying so fast that you can slip past traffic and the radar cops. The propulsion system, derived from SpaceX's Merlin and Raptor engines, enhances fuel efficiency by 30% compared to traditional military aircraft. Now that's the kind of efficiency we could use in our morning coffee. Challenges on the horizon. Now, before you start daydreaming about your next vacation in just 90 minutes, let's talk about the significant challenges that lie ahead. Developing hypersonic technology isn't as simple as slapping a jet engine on a toaster. Engineers must overcome hurdles like thermal management, propulsion efficiency, and developing new materials that can withstand the extreme temperatures of hypersonic flight. Seriously, it's hot enough to fry an egg on the wing. The intense heat generated at hypersonic speeds poses a real challenge. And let's be honest, we've all seen what happens when you forget to take the pizza out of the oven. Imagine that but on a much larger and much more expensive scale. The Concorde, a fond farewell. To appreciate where we're going, let's take a moment to remember the Concorde. This sleek and futuristic aircraft was the rock star of the skies for over 27 years. Introduced in 1976, it could fly at a blazing speed, more than twice as fast as regular airplanes. It meant passengers could travel from New York to London in under three hours instead of the usual seven to eight. However, despite its groundbreaking speed, the Concorde fell short of reaching hypersonic speeds, which start at Mach 5. Still, it was an icon of aviation technology and luxury travel until its retirement in 2003. Interestingly, during its retirement journey, a Concorde named JBOG flew from New York to Seattle in just three hours, 55 minutes, and 12 seconds. Not bad for a farewell tour, huh? But here's the catch. Supersonic flight had its challenges. Noise concerns meant supersonic flights over land were restricted in many countries, including the United States. So the Concorde could only unleash its speed over oceans. For that record-breaking New York to Seattle flight, Canadian authorities had to grant special permission for the Concorde to fly at supersonic speed over sparsely populated areas of Canada. Talk about making some diplomatic friends. Hermes, the new challenger. With the Concorde now a sweet memory, various companies are stepping up to the plate, eager to pick up where it left off. Enter Hermes, an ambitious startup founded in 2018 that aims to not only match the Concorde's achievements, but to surpass them. Their goal? To develop hypersonic passenger aircraft that can fly at speeds over Mach 5, leaving the Concorde in the dust. Imagine flying across the Atlantic in just 90 minutes, making same-day round trips between continents a reality. Hermes's CEO, AJ Piplia, 
has gathered a talented team of engineers from leading aerospace companies like SpaceX and Blue Origin. These experts bring valuable experience from the space industry where achieving high speeds is not just a goal, it's a matter of survival. The Chimera engine, a mythical marvel, at the heart of Hermes's ambitious plan is the revolutionary Chimera engine. Named after the fire-breathing monster from Greek mythology, this engine represents a fusion of different technologies, kind of like a transformer, but with fewer explosions. The Chimera engine is a turbine-based combined cycle engine, which means it combines the best features of various jet engines to overcome their limitations. Turbojet, ramjet, and scramjet engines are the main types involved. Turbojets, which power most of today's commercial aircraft, work great up to about twice the speed of sound, Mach 2. But once you hit that sweet spot of Mach 5, they struggle like a kid trying to run a marathon after a sugar binge. On the flip side, ramjets and scramjets excel at very high speeds, but can't operate efficiently at lower speeds. The Chimera engine aims to bridge this gap by using a turbojet for takeoff and initial acceleration, then switching to a ramjet mode for high-speed cruise. So, you get the best of both worlds, like a buffet with all your favorite dishes. To develop this complex engine, Hermes took an innovative approach. Instead of reinventing the wheel, they used readily available off-the-shelf gas turbine engines for the initial turbojet component. This strategy saved them billions of dollars and years of time, like finding a cheat code in a video game. The quarter horse project testing the waters, but how do you test something as groundbreaking as the Chimera engine? Enter the quarter horse project. Hermes has ambitious plans to create a series of increasingly advanced aircraft to demonstrate their hypersonic capabilities. The Quarter Horse isn't just one aircraft, it's a family of prototypes, each designed to push the boundaries of speed and performance. The MK-0, the Groundbreaker. The journey begins with the Quarter Horse MK-0, a ground test vehicle designed to evaluate various systems before any actual flight takes place. In early 2024, Hermes announced the completion of tests on the MK-0 at the Air Force's Arnold Engineering Development Complex in Tennessee. During these tests, the MK-0 achieved several important milestones, including demonstrating its ability to control the vehicle from a distance, essential for future unmanned flights. They tested speed and reliability of communications between the vehicle and ground control, proving that they can communicate better than most of us do with our family on a holiday. What's particularly impressive is that Hermes designed and built the MK-0 in just six months, completing all these tests in only 37 days. This rapid development cycle showcases the company's agile approach to aerospace engineering. Who knew engineers could work so fast? They must have some secret coffee supply. As Hermes continues to refine its groundbreaking technology, we might soon see a revolution in long-distance air travel. With the potential to make international trips faster and more efficient, hypersonic flight could reshape how we connect with the world. Thanks for flying with us today. If you enjoyed the ride, hit that subscribe button before you leave. Because who wouldn't want to keep up with the next wave of aviation magic? While you're still here, click on the link on your screen to check out another one of our videos. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button before you go, or else you might miss the next big thing in aviation. And trust me, you won't want to be stuck at the airport when hypersonic flights become a reality. See you there.